now i am going to teach you the how the absolute code sorry how the coordinate system working uh, what are the types how we are going to managing in the manufacturing process like that there are three types of coordinate system first we talk about first absolute coordinate system we just select this one click here click absolute and click it to okay see whatever the x y z which is coffee color actually showing in now that one is absolute coordinate system and uh, next one is uh, let's see talk about uh, wcs this is a work coordinate system we can change this one by using the values of x y z wherever we want we can keep it for example i'm not just giving yeah so take it as 20 this is 20 yeah this will be moved now we can see that its actual position will be changes first value i given that it will changes to here then it will changes to here click okay if i want to draw anything on that particular thing i'm just selecting wait wait i'm just selecting a block if i am selecting a block uh is given 20 here given 20 and we're selecting this point okay so somewhere it is to be wrong come back yeah okay. one more thing i uh, i forgot to tell you the absolute coordinate system never changes and uh, whatever we did na wcs coordinate system or coordinate system how many it will be temporary one we can change it to anywhere or uh, any multiple times how many times we required for that particular thing we can make it a replica means replica of that otherwise we can make multiple ones see i did multiple one my here if i'm selecting this one see y c c which will be showing that work coordinate system we can take how many times we required this is the not the real one cancel it i will undo on that one and first one is the absolute coordinate system and the second one is wcs coordinate system now we are entering into the manufacturing process there we can see that machine coordinate system which will be representing in the in the form of zm ym xm whatever the post processor which will be builded 
means building means generating a program whatever thing will be there na that will be based on that particular thing this zm ym xm like that here by using this coordinate system wcs coordinate system we can drag to here by using this arrow direction see 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 you directly by holding this one you can keep it wherever you want by using this small small notes with the jarna by using this one you can give the rotation rotation of this one okay i'm clicking okay we are entering into the manufacturing na we we'll just see there i am selecting sorry in that one in that one whatever the zm is there na it automatically moves towards whatever the xc xc zc yc will be there na there it will be moved you just see Okay. It will not showing properly. can see that what is this one go to menu go to format go to wcs dynamic I want to keep this one next to here. Can keep it. Click OK. Then I will tell you. I tell to this program to move where the WCS is there. Will move. See. See. Okay. now you can see that this is the first firstly i will tell you that this is an absolute coordinate system it is first one which i thought before na first one the second one is work coordinate system work coordinate system is a temporary one we can create multiple things third one is machine coordinate system where the post processor will be building means whatever the program you will be generating depending upon that the program this particular zm will be the main thing and one more thing i forgot to tell you the whatever z profile programming we will be doing na for that one uh, the post processor will be re referring as a zc means work coordinate system the next episode will be continuing now i am stopping the uh, this episode episode thank you and don't forget to subscribe my channel you will get more information and more videos thank you